Hello patients, it's Ballistic Krill, Ultimate Zombies Medic. Now you're probably watching this because you were just playing zombies and now you're pretty mad that you don't have all the permafurks. So I'm going to show you how to get them all in this tutorial. Alright, so this first one's Quick Revive. It's uh, my first personal favorite, obviously, on the medic. So. Confused. so basically you just need to get a lot of revives in one game. It's pretty simple, you can do it with someone the AFK, like I did, or uh, just uh, normally I get a lot of revives in one game. As you can, as you can tell, there's uh, purple words instead of regular uh, white words. That's how you know when you get it. Also, there'll be a flash of green light, like you saw earlier. It's about twice as fast, and if you get the actual perk quick revive while you have this, it'll, it'll um, its effect will double again. So, that's pretty useful. Okay, here is how you get perma juds, which is permanent juggernaut. It's fairly simple. You just get into a solo game by quick revive down three times with quick revive, obviously, so then you come back to life. And uh, on the third try, you will ha uh, have a flash of green light, and you'll have perma jugs. Slain on the most plebeian of transportation by a wretched group of reanimated husks. Well, I am grateful to not be dead. Perhaps. Odd. I have never heard that before. Ah. Alright, so you saw that flash of green light, that's how you know when you get a uh, perma perk. Also, I don't know if you heard it, but he said uh, the phrase, I've never heard this before, or something like that. And he says that whenever you get a perk, which makes this interesting, because supposedly, if you get a triple collateral headshot, or, you know, quad collateral, anything like that, you get deadshot daiquiri as a permanent perk. Now, right here, you can see that flash of green light when I got a triple collateral headshot, so... That may be uh, a perk that you can get. I can't verify that though, as a uh, like proven perk. Right, so here's how to get the perma insta kill. Now, the thing about this is, it isn't quite a perk since it's a uh, power up that you get off the ground, but it's still good to have. You picked up an insta kill. Now, you're supposed to just not kill anything. But I found that it works the best when it's in between rounds like this. Like sometimes I'll pick up an insta kill and not kill anything, and uh, it just won't count for uh, the thing. So try it. if you can do it in between rounds. Okay. Also, you might notice I killed denizens. Now those die during insta kill, which I don't know. They apparently don't count. Now you notice here, there's a flash, and he says a quote. So. That's how you know when you get that, is when you hear the quote and there's a flash of green light. Alright, then when you do that, you pick up an insta-kill and there will be a red insta-kill symbol above the regular insta-kill. And that means that it's working, I don't know if you saw that, but I just ran directly into some zombies and they died upon contact. So that's basically what that does. Also, it goes away, it lasts half as long as regular insta-kill. So be careful of that because you might run into a horde when you're out of ammo trying to kill them like that and you'll just you'll just die. So be careful. Alright, now I'm gonna show you how to get reinforced barriers. It's not quite a perk also, but it's very useful to have. It just fits a lot of barriers and you will have it. Uh, it's easiest to do this in the bus. It'll make a reinforced barrier such as that one. You'll also see another one right here. I don't know if you can see the bolts on it, but it's made of metal, and it takes them three times to pull it off instead of one. Very useful, it keeps the bus from being overridden. Alright, if you like this, like, comment, subscribe. Remember, subscribe today, and the medic will revive you.